This video is sponsored by Oculus. I've had a VR set for over a year now, yet you may have noticed that I only actually have one VR video on my channel. The reason for this is that I've always found that I would much rather just play a game on my PC than have to spend a bunch of time setting up sensors, making space and configuring my VR set. It always seemed like a lot of work for me when I could just start playing my PC games instantly. Of course, this isn't a problem for everyone. Some people just have enough space in their room to have their VR set up all the time. But to me, the setup has always been a drawback with VR, and I believe it acts as a partial barrier for new people starting in VR. And that's why I was so happy to get the opportunity to try out Oculus's new Rift S, because I believe that this new VR set from Oculus is the perfect entry point for any PC gamers wanting to start VR gaming. So what makes me say that? Why do I believe the Oculus Rift S is the perfect entry point for PC gamers, and what makes it more usable than any other VR set? You open the box and are greeted by the entire set on display. The Rift S headset, the two controllers, a cable and some batteries, and that's it. Most sensors needing to be mounted on tripods or drilled into a wall, just the headset and controllers. After realizing that was the case, I was hugely excited because it looked like it meant VR was no longer going to be a long setup process for me, and it wasn't. The Rift S, instead of using external sensors taking up space in your room, it uses all internal sensors inside the headset, and from my experience, they work perfectly. Often in my cramped room with my old VR set, I would lose tracking on one of the controllers or the headset itself simply by walking too close to one of the sensors. And with this, those days are gone. The headset itself is simple and comfortable, and the controllers are light and small, so I had no problem using them for extended periods. Overall, I'm extremely happy with the Rift S and would genuinely recommend it to anyone looking to get into VR. And Oculus told me not to say anything I don't truly believe, so you can trust that I'm being truthful when I say I love this product. Not having external sensors isn't the only benefit of the set. There's also only one cable that splits into two going into your PC. No hub needed, just a USB port and a display port. It also has inbuilt speakers, new lenses, and a sharper display. With these upgrades, you get a brighter experience with more vivid colors and a reduced screen door effect. The Oculus software also has hundreds of game titles, including Oculus exclusive titles. Anyone who watches my streams knows I love cars. And because of this, I also love racing games. I think this will be perfect for racing or flying simulator games that support VR. I never really knew how to set up a VR set to be comfortable while seated at a desk using a racing wheel or a flat stick, but because I no longer need to figure out how to position sensors around my desk, it's going to be really easy. So let's jump into some gameplay and show it off. Whoa. Um, just ignore that. The crazy thing about racing in VR is, is these arms are where my arms are on the, on the, uh, on the wheel. So it feels so good. Oh, oh, oh. Shit. Whoa, oh, oh. Man, I cannot do that corner. All right, so welcome to Super Hot VR. Now, obviously, because I'm in normal VR, I've had to switch to my lav mic. I am aware that the audio sounds worse, and I am sorry for that, but that is just the way it is. So. For, an who, for anyone who doesn't know what Super Hot is, uh, basically, time only moves when you move, and it is so much fun in VR. Avoiding people's gunshots in VR is very, very fun. Would strongly recommend. <laughs> that didn't work. Oh, we got someone behind us. And I am out of ammo. Oh, and I've died. <laughs> This is actually one of the best VR experiences I've ever had. This game is incredible. And this headset is working flawlessly. You know, you, you, you hear senseless VR. Well, I mean, it isn't senseless. It does have sensors. But you hear that the sensors are internal and you assume that it's not going to be 
you know, you assume there's no way it's going to be as good as, you know, the competitors with, with the sensors on the outside. But, man, it is pretty incredible how good they work. Oh, and I have missed that knife. Oh, there's someone behind me. Did I get them all? Oh, that was so badass. Oh, how the f am I supposed to do that? Uh huh. Whoa! You As you can see, everything's working perfectly. That's the guy that always gets me. We did it! We did I think I think when it says super hot, that's the checkpoint. Bye bye. Did I just hit that bullet with my with my uh with my gun there? Come on, shoot me. Hey look, it's the guy I killed. Alright, here we go. Deflecting bullets. Is there someone else? What's happening here? Oh, we got you. Hello. If if you guys pick up this this uh, VR, which I strongly recommend, I would highly recommend getting super hot. In my opinion, one of the best VR experiences you can have at this point in time. Hey. Alright, what do we go? Oh, too easy, mate. Too easy. Uh, sorry, I need this. Thank you. <laughs> Hello, my friend. Shit, that hasn't gone to plan. That has not gone to plan whatsoever. Let's go, baby. <laughs> this game just makes you feel like the biggest badass in the room. Well, that didn't work. <laughs> no. Oh. Oh. Damn it, that's missing. Can I grab the bullets? That'd be so sick. Come here. <gasps> Damn it, I just wanted to try and grab the bullet. John in the morning, never been disappointed. Got fits in this bitch in the hit start poor rejected twist 20k bitch. I'm in it to win and killing my enemies. Never feeling sentimental, potentially a villain. Essentially, I've risen to the top. No stop. See, yes, go. Motherfucker rush B, I know. Never been able to rhyme slow, and I gotta get it like whoa. AKA spray any shots for the lames. I've been wasting no time. I ain't playing no games. I got skins on deck. I just slipped the check, and anybody got a problem, they gon' end up wrecked.